Hello everyone, Pixels Monk here, and today we are going to look at this week's updates and news for Old School RuneScape. This week, Jagex has added the master tier clue scrolls and has expanded on clues in general. Currently, there are only two ways in which you can get a master clue scroll, as a reward from another clue scroll or by handing one of each tier clue scroll to Watson, who is found on Zaya. There are a lot of new challenges and puzzles that have been incorporated into the Master Clues, including Follow the Bard, Hot and Cold, more puzzle boxes, and light box puzzles. Follow the Bard is a musician who sings about various items that are throughout the world of RuneScape, however he tends to forget what those items are. It is up to you to bring that item to him so that he can remember. Follow the Bard sits just west of the Sinclair Mansion, north of Camelot. To complete the hot and cold puzzle, we are going back to our childhood games where you'll be given a strange device, which determines whether you are hot or cold, and as you get closer to the clue location, the hotter you'll get. However, this item will deal damage every time that it is used and can kill you. There has also been an expansion to the puzzle boxes, which adds three new images to complete. The light box puzzle features lights and buttons. Each button will turn on or off a certain set of lights. Your job will be to get all the lights turned on at once. All of the already existing clue scrolls have gotten a very large expansion as well, which includes new clues, rewards, and a new challenge. This new challenge is called Cypher, which is only available for the medium and hard clue scrolls. This challenge will give you a set of letters that you must decipher to determine the location for the next clue. New rewards have been added to every tier of clue scrolls, including trimmed steel, gold aprons, and much more cosmetic gear. The master clues can also give you a third age pickaxe, axe, and even a slim chance at receiving a bloodhound pet. These are only a few of the rewards that have been added to the game, hundreds more are available. Lucky implings have been added as well that require 89 Hunter to catch or level 99 barehanded. Once caught, these implings will give you one roll on the clue scroll drop table. You can also receive clue scrolls from mining and wood cutting now, so watch out for those bird's nests. Next week, the hidey holes will be added to RuneScape as Jagex stated that there wasn't enough time this week to do so, which will only make clue scroll hunting that much more fun. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to stay tuned for next week's old school RuneScape update and news video to keep up on the latest in Gilinor. If you did enjoy this video, please share it with other people that would like it, and I'll see you next time.